What up, YouTube? Relax, Jigo Player coming at you guys with a little tech update or a possible uh, staple or side deck card for the next um, after the next set comes down. <laughs> um, well, not the next one. Uh, as soon as we get Pendulum Summon Monsters, um, the game's not going to change super drastically as much as everybody thinks. The first set uh, it may change a little bit because obviously there are going to be pendulums that are going to be um, decent enough to be able to summon a bunch of monsters, but if they do ever become threatening and uh, become something that's so good that uh, you know they can just pull it off first turn every time, you know, try to go for the OTKs. We do have this card right here that is really, really good against pendulum summoning. For all of you that don't know what it does, you have two pendulum zones: one on the left side of the mat, and then one on the right side. They're in between the spell and traps and the monsters, and then. Uh, you know, the, well, it's in between the field and the extra deck, and then the main and the uh, the deck area and the graveyard. Um, you have pendulum scales, and you can summon. So you have a pendulum scale of one on the left side and an eight on the right side. You can do two through seven, any level from two to seven, as many as you want, from your hand and or extra deck. But you can only do pendulum monsters from the extra deck. Um, they have to be regular monsters, they can't be synchros or Xyz, but the thing is, say you have gadgets, for example, best best deck really that I can think of, say you have a green, red, and yellow in your hand, uh, somehow, <laughs> um, and you have two pendulums, and it's one to eight, so you can summon two to seven, and that's cool. Um, you can just activate the pendulum for the one turn, you get one pendulum summon per turn, so basically it's a free special summon. You'd be able to special all their gadgets, and yes, all of their effects would resolve. But the card that I want to show you is this right here. Um, okay, so this card is definitely going to change the way that it works. Need needle sealing is good as well, but this card completely blows out pendulum summoning. Um, it's called Deep Dark Trap Hole. Um, they actually did change the name, so now it's called Dark Fall. But the reason I wanted to bring this card about to your attention because this card, um, first off, uh, if you can see what set it's from, nope, it's not going to zoom in, let me see if I can get it, it's from Star Strike Blast, whatever, <laughs> um, as you all know, Star Strike Blast has not been reprinted a single time, barely anything in there has been reprinted, um, you know, Vajrayana, I think, <laughs> a few other cards possibly that I can think of, but nothing uh, extraordinary, you know, nothing, not a lot of them, this card right here, what this does. Let me see if I can try to zoom in. Um, Alright, so activate only while your opponent only when your opponent special summons two or more monsters face up. Send all those monsters to the graveyard. Now, so first off, it does not destroy it. Sends them to the graveyard. So they pendulum three or four monsters, they're all going to the grave. Then send all monsters in the opponent's hand and deck to the graveyard that have the same name as either of those monsters. So if they summon three monsters with three different names, and they have multiple copies in their hand and deck, this card right here will send every single one of those to the grave. So this card right here, 100%, if you can get this off against when they pendulum summon, you're pretty much probably going to win that game or the mat, uh, you know the game. Um, the reason I wanted to bring this to your attention is because, like I said, it's out of Star Strike Blast. It's going to be hard to find, and this card is definitely going to be one of them cards. I'm not exactly sure if it's going to be main deck material, but side deck 100%. Um, once pendulums become more prevalent to where most decks are using them, and uh, the decks that don't pendulum summon kind of go out of cycle, this may even be staple. So, yes, um, if you do have these, I want them as well. <laughs> um, I will trade you know, good for them. And um, it's out of the same set as Vanity's Emptiness, which is a common. It's out of the same set as um, you draw on Lockbird, some crazy cards, I don't know. I can't think of any other ones right now. Vedrana, whatever. Um, but this card, um, like I said, I definitely want to update you as my subscribers. Uh, I, don't, I don't have a lot. I have like 30-something, which I'm working on, hopefully. <laughs> but this is uh, going to be the bomb. You can just, like I said, it's called Dark Fall. Um, it is called Dark Trap Hole now, uh, on this card at least, but they changed the name to Dark Fall. Um, it would be too good with Trap Tricks. 
basically. <laughs> but um, definitely, if you guys can, um, I'm gonna try to make more videos of cards like this. That this is really not even out there. Um, this literally probably is gonna skyrocket once the pendulums come out. But um, if you like videos like this, that might help you out. Maybe um, if you always say Yu-Gi-Oh is expensive, it's really not. You get this card for a dollar now. Save it. Down the road, it's six dollars, five dollars, four dollars, whatever. As long as it's two dollars, you you doubled your money. That's what that's what Yu-Gi-Oh is about. You can make, you know, you can work a trade binder up. You can have a crappy binder, and then you can get a good one by trading up. And if you say you can't get the stuff you need, eventually you should have what you need. Uh, after it may take time, but hey, that's how I got my last binder. But I sold it, and now I'm working on it again. And I have 30 something of these coming in the mail for 25 cents each. So eventually they'll be at least a dollar. So that's quadruple my money. If I get four or five dollars a piece, that would be even better. <laughs> but um, definitely don't forget to thumbs up the video if you like videos like this. And uh, don't forget, if you haven't subscribed already, definitely do. I have some more dual videos coming up. I am going to locals tomorrow. And I want to thank you all for watching the video. And uh, Dark Trapple. <laughs> Peace out.